Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight we're coming to you from beautiful Levy County. We're in the town of Bronson. We're at Lot 11 Northeast 67th Street here in beautiful Bronson, Florida. Uh, it's going to be a .24 of an acre. It's going to be 65 foot across the front and back, 160 foot down either side. So you got a nice 10,400 square foot rectangular property right here. Uh, it's in the beautiful Bronson Heights second edition subdivision. Taxes on this property are very low at $74.58 under $75 a year in taxes for this beautiful 10,400 square foot property. Uh, again, it's going to be a well and septic, so when you get ready to put your mobile on here or your site built home or whatever you're going to put on here, you need to install a well and septic system for the property. Uh, again, it's going to be a 10,400 square foot buildable lot here, uh, lot 11 Northeast 67th Street in Bronson. The location on this property is absolutely outstanding. Uh, you're one block off of State Road 27, just right behind Sam there. State Road 27 runs east and west through Bronson, Williston, and Levy County uh, itself. So you're going to have, uh, once you hit State Road 27, you take a right. Uh, you're five minutes to the downtown Bronson area. A nice little small mom and pop uh, uh, quiet town right there. They'll have everything you're going to need commercially for uh, to sustain life here. And again, it's all small town mom and pop shops. Uh, again, if you want to, if you're looking for the big box stores or some of the bigger box stores and the bigger grocery stores, you want to head to uh, once you hit 27, take a left. You're about 12 minutes to the downtown Williston area. Williston's a slightly larger town than Bronson. It'll have some of your larger uh, box stores and then your uh, um, fast food and whatever is going to be right there as well. Also, if you want to get out into the Gulf of Mexico and do some fishing, you got 25 minutes to the Cedar Carrier just to our west from this location, so you're not far from uh, the Gulf of Mexico as well. And also, you got the beautiful uh, prehistoric Devil's Den and the Blue Grotto Spring about 10 minutes down to, uh, State Road 27 to the east as well. Also, the largest town to you uh, from here, if you want to get into uh, the, the largest town that's going to have all your big box stores like the Home Depots, Walmart, Superstores, and all that stuff. You want to get into the Ocala, or excuse me, the uh, Gainesville area. It's going to be about 25 minutes just to the northeast from this location. All right, so now we have, uh, again, we're at Lot 11, Northeast 67th Street. We're going to go ahead and show you the 65 foot across the front of your property here uh, that sits right on the 67th is, again, is a well-maintained dirt road. And again, you have a, a neighbor uh, or power is about 230 foot down the road there. You got three or four lots, five lots in between you here. Uh, so again, power's not far off whatsoever. And again, you have neighbors all around you here. Uh, and you'll see that on the drone footage. Uh, this neighborhood's coming up and coming. All right, now we're going to show you the 65 foot across the front of your lot here at Lot 11 Northeast 67th Street. And we'll see you there. All right, we showed you the 65 foot across the front of your property here at uh, Lot 11 Northeast 67th Street. As you can see, 67th Street is a dirt road. It's well maintained. I was able to get my truck up and down here. And again, you do have a neighbor just about four lots just to the other side of that tree there where, where the tree pokes out there. You got a neighbor right in there, mobile home right in there. So again, you do have power just that far. It's about 200 foot, maybe 230 foot. Uh, but again, all of this to my left, 10,400 square foot of it is uh, what is up for auction tonight. And again, you can see there's on this lot, maybe one or two oak trees, a couple pine trees. I see a stand of oaks in the back there. We'll, see, we'll get to that uh, area as well. But again, this one wouldn't take much. It looks like it was actually cleared at one point. Uh, you can see the private property signs the sellers put on the on the property here, uh, basically just to keep people off from riding their motorcycles and things of that nature, I'm sure. Uh, but again, you got a beautiful 10,400 square foot lot here. Now we're going to go 160 foot all the way back to the northwest corner of your property, and we'll see you there. All right, we made it 160 foot all the way to the back northwest corner of your lot here at North uh, Lot 11 Northeast 67th Street. Uh, all of this to my right is your property. As you can see, it's not a whole lot going on there. Looks like it might have been cleared at one point. Uh, again, there's a no trespassing sign up there. The seller put on uh, this lot and the lot next door, number 10. But again, number 11 definitely looks like it was a lot clearer than number 10. But again. Now we're going to get uh, 
again, it wouldn't take much at all to clean this up whatsoever. As you can see here, there's not a you got a pine tree, oak tree, and a couple other small pines, and a lot of this smaller brush here. Uh, bush hog would just run right over there and clean this up for you. So now we're going to go 65 foot east across the back of your lot, and we'll see you there. All right, we made it 65 foot all the way to the northeast corner of your lot here at lot 11 northeast 67th Street. And again, all of this is uh, a stand of palms right there on the corner of your lot. Uh, I don't see too many palms out here. But again, you have a couple oak trees up in the front, dead oak tree there, some pine trees, and a lot of smaller oak trees on here. So again, this lot will look like it would be pretty easy to clear up. Uh, a couple guys probably do it in one day. On a bush hog, and you got a couple of other trees that kind of fell over. But again, not a whole lot. Lot is very level, as you can see through the uh, the presentation. And again, it's just beautiful out here, nice and quiet. If you're looking for quietness, this is where the place to come. Lot 11, Northeast 67th Street. Now we're going to head back up to the front of your lot, uh, 160 foot, and we'll see you there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, there we had it. We made our way back up to the front here. Again, it's a little uh, over overgrown there on the corner there. You have uh, these dead shrubs that I was telling you about right there, and it's got a big stand of them right there. But we kind of made it across the front. The front of your lot here is fairly pretty clear. Again, actually, the whole lot is clear. It looks like it was cleared at one point. It had to have been uh, because, again, you only got one couple oak trees, a couple pine trees on the property here. Again, it wouldn't take much at all to clean this thing up and get it ready to go. Again, we're at Lot 11, Northeast 67th Street here in beautiful Bronson, Florida. It's going to be a .24 of an acre, 65 foot across the front and back, 160 foot down either side. Makes this a beautiful, nice rectangular property there. And again, one thing I like about these rectangular properties is I would probably put my house closer to the back and have a nice private drive and keep all my toys and everything in the back there as well. That's one of the things like I like about the the rectangular compared to the square uh, lots. You got a little couple more options you have uh, with that property. Uh, again, it's going to be 10,400 square foot of buildable lot, uh, buildable land here. Again, you can put a site build home on here, manufactured home, mobile home, whatever you want to do, because we are in the unincorporated area of Levy County here in the Bronson Heights uh, second edition subdivision. But again, very beautiful property right here. And again, very level. Wouldn't take much at all to clean it up. Again, you could probably get a a crew of two guys out here in a bush hog and a couple chainsaws and, and knock this out in a day or two. Again, it's going to be well and septic, so when you get put your mobiles on here, you're going to have to install a well and septic system. Now, the location is absolutely outstanding. One block off of State Road 27, right behind Sam, it runs east and west. Uh, once you head east, or excuse me, if you once you hit 27, you head west, you're going to be in the Bronson, downtown Bronson area, less than five minutes from this location. You head west or east, you're going to be uh, about 10 minutes, 12 minutes into the Williston area, about 10 minutes to the prehistoric spring and the Blue Grotto Spring, down 27. Now, if you wanted to get out and take off of Mexico, do some fishing, you got the Cedar Key area, just about 25 minutes just to our west from this, low, southwest from this location. So, again, you can be out in the game, you can be out into the Gulf of Mexico in less than an hour here. Uh, from this location doing some great fishing right now. Uh, again, the largest town closest to you is going to be Gainesville, which is going to be to our northeast, about 25 minutes from this location as well. Uh, and again, if you win this at auction tonight, you want to fly in, check out this beautiful property here. Uh, maybe come around, meet your neighbors, get out to Cedar Key, get some great seafood and do some fishing. You want to fly into the Ocala International Airport. That's going to be just directly to our east, about 20 minutes from this location. So again, Lot 11, Northeast 67th Street here, beautiful 10,400 square foot, mobile friendly, buildable land here in the Bronson Heights edition, uh, two, second edition here in uh, the subdivision. Again, Lot 11, Northeast 67th Street. Good luck at the auction, and we'll see you there.